Hey everybody, welcome back. Welcome to Something Old, Something New Car Rips. I'm Lance Day of Sunday, so we're going to review some football. Today we have the collectible card club box. This is the Platinum Edition, Modern and Vintage. It uh, was $60.95 $60 and it's supposed to contain 15 packs. So you're not going to get any high-end packs, but you're going to get you know 15 packs of cards. So it's pretty always a fun rip. I've been on the football, Modern and Vintage for a while now. And uh, it's always been fun. They... Uh, Pretty much kind of had the same pack lineup for a while though, so we'll see if that stays true. And that, so right off the top, yep, there's 88 tops. We've had the 88 tops. Like the very one of the very first boxes we got, we had got the uh, Bo Jackson out of there already though. So we always can get another Bo Jackson. I'm not sure how many boxes they have, how many of these they put together, but let's see what we got. We got 2021 contenders. We got some 2000 tops NFL. Some 14 Prestige, some, I can't remember what was that year, Upper Deck 98, 95 Tops Finest, that's pretty cool, some Select from 2020, Blaster Pack it looks like, Contenders 2015, Absolute, 5 card pack, one of those, I actually saw these at uh, GameStop, they wanted 4 bucks a piece for those, I'm pretty sure those are the Dollar Tree packs. Action Pack, Predator Edition, ABC, I think we had that last time, 1990 Pro Set, 88 Tops, 2020 Chronicles, also from a Blaster Box, Prism Draft Picks, another 95 Tops Stadium Club, and 2021 Score, 12 cards for a pack, so lots of Blaster Packs. So let's start off with this 88 since we already pulled a... Bo Jackson before, like I said, you can always get another one, a nice one in the middle. Our Thousand Yard Club card is Chris Burkett, there's a Phil, Phyllis Epps, Mike Rand, there's a Roger Craig, what was it, uh, Cash and Jow were just sharing a nice TTM of his, there's a Joe Montana, so there's a nice card, there's a Richard Dent. Brother's a big Bears fan. There's a Kurt Warner. He was their rushing leader. And Steve Largent. 58 receptions. Not a big year for them offensively, it doesn't look like. Mark Murphy. And a Ricky Sanders. He had some good seasons over there with Art Monk. Gary Clark. Moving on to this 2020 Chronicles football. Hard to believe that the Super Bowl was just a week ago. Feels like longer than that. There's a nice Ray Lewis. Cam Newton in the base. There's a Jake Fromm. The purple. There's a J.K. Dobbins. Clear uh, rated rookie. Hopefully he comes back next year and has a great season. Just because I have a ton of his cards. There's a Justin Jefferson. And the Gridiron King. So a couple good rookies in there. Or good rookies from their year. 2021 Prism Draft Picks. Be interesting to see which one of these quarterbacks ends up being the guy going forward. There's a nice Gardner Minshew talking about Cash and Dad. Big Cougar fans. Brandon Ayuk. There's a Zach Wilson parallel. It's a sweet looking card. We'll put that up in the top. Who knows? Maybe he'll get his chance and have a better sophomore season. They seem to give up on these quarterbacks a lot quicker than they used to. Moving on to the 1995 Top Stadium Club Extreme NFL. Random par card, my laser cut, oh, MVP laser cuts. So looks like there's a bunch of inserts we can find. Find some nice Hall of Famers. There's a Leon Lett. Merton Inks. Um, these are going to be all over the place. Just like Steam Club always is. Uh, Bill Hitchcock, Don Griffin versus Vince Workman. Patrick Bates, Reggie Brooks. There's a draft pick of Michael Westbrook. It's a cool card. Just pick him up all the time in uh, Madden because he was cheap. Mark Carrier, Ken Norton, and a Johnny Mitchell. There's no big, big names in there. 2021 score. There's a Zach Thomas, some base cars, Patrick Queen, Kirk Cousins, see how he does with his new core, uh, coach, J. 
Josh Jacobs, rookies, Demetri Felton, Sean Wade, Shai Smith, Hunter Renfro, there's a Jared Goff, and an Alvin Kamara. It's not much in there either. 1990 Pro Set. But definitely a nice little stack of packs. Probably going to switch back to the baseball. There's a nice Dan Marino. Put that in our top five. Tom Landry. Keith Jackson. Lindy Infante. There's a Mark Clayton. From the Mark Duper, Mark Clayton. Bruce Matthews, Pro Bowl. Houston Oilers. And Super Bowl 16. That was the last time the Bengals were in the Super Bowl. 49ers, Bengals. Ah, oh, I remember that game not being that close. I didn't realize it was 26-21. to 21. I thought the 49ers, yeah. I think that was like one of the first Super Bowls I actually sat and down and watched when I was a little kid. Moving on to the Premier Action Edition, Monday Night Football. There's 24 karat gold leaf cards. So apparently that's probably what we're looking for. Obviously, if it's 24 karat gold, there's a Stan Humphreys. These are going to be sticking a little bit. Jerry Rice, it's a cool looking card. January 3rd, 1994. That's what the backs of them look like. Mark Higgs. Haywood Jeffries. There's a Brett Favre. He was always big on Monday nights. Put that up there. This is a sweet looking card. And a Seth Joyner. Moving on. What's this? What's oh, to this absolute five card pack. Kind of curious what's in here because I was looking at those packs and I was wondering if it would be worth it. Elijah Moore. And a couple of pink parallels. Nico Collins. Philip Lindsay. So no, it would not have been worth it. 2015 Contenders. There's all your top rookies on the front there. What happens with Jameis Winston. Saints seem to be in disarray. They're way over the salary cap. That team's going to have some issues going forward. There's a nice Frank Gore. Timeless one. Richard Sherman. Julio Jones. And Jared Cook. So, some names in there at least. Select 2020. Do miss opening up Select 2020. Didn't really get much packs back then, but uh, these are just some really nice looking cards. This is Chief or Clyde Edwards Hilaire. There's a nice Jonathan Taylor. He had a monster season. The orange parallel or die cut parallel. That's a cool car. We'll put that in our top five. Tony Gonzalez, Unbreakable. That's a nice looking car, too. And a Zeke. Moving on to Top's Finest. Oh, this was Top's Finest. That's why I got it wrong. I think it was Stadium Club for some reason. Hopefully they're not sticking. They got this protective coating on them. Starting off with a kicker, John Carney, Chris Warren, Mark Carrier for the second time this break. Really, Mark Carrier the second time in this pack. What? There's only... Wow. And Daryl Green, fastest man in the NFL for a while. Black Diamond, only 50 of the quadruple Black Diamond cars. So that's the ones we're looking for. There's a Frank Wycheck. Oh, these are going to be sticking bad. Neil O'Donnell. Carnell Lake. Come on. There's a Marcus Allen. That's a sweet looking card. A nice Junior Seau. Look at these pretty intense there. I'll just get this off there. I mean, he's always intense. Drew Bledsoe and a Dave Brown. We got three three packs left. 2014 Heritage. Just looking for the Aaron Donald. Mostly. There's some of the other okay rookies in here. Rashad Jennings. There's the big board for 
that guy, Demarcus Lawrence, MJD, Ben Tate, and Heath Miller. Moving on to the 2000 All Pro Pro Bowl player worn jersey cards. This is pretty thin, so I'm pretty sure we don't have a player worn jersey card in here. That's got Peyton Manning on there. A little baby blue action going on. Jake the Snake Plumber. That's a cool looking card, though. I like the 2000 tops on there. Jermaine Lewis, Richie Anderson, Dave Moore. Cornelius Bennett, Kevin Williams, Sean King, Alanis Gray, Tremaine Mack, and a Ray Lucas, a Millennium Milestones. So that was not a very good pack. Here's the back of these if you've never seen them before. Pretty cool looking cards. Oh, and our last pack, 2021 Contenders College Draft Picks. Nice chance to get a hit out of here. Patrick Mahomes, Joe Burrow, Minka Fitzpatrick, Tylen Wallace, front row seats, red parallel, Cam Newton, and Aaron Donald for Pitt. Looking young there. So there you go. Let me know what you thought of the pack selection there. If you agree with the top five, and if you didn't agree with the top five, what you'd put in your top five. As always, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great rest of your week and your weekend, and I'll catch you next time.